right, we just came down from, from up there somewhere. You can actually see the uh, rest stop building right over there. And up there is uh, the top of uh, South Kaibab. Working our way down. Finally got a little breeze going. It was, came from around the thing. Uh, there is uh, Plateau Point over there. So you know Indian Gardens is back through that valley over there. Um, I forgot what they call this thing. And then Marky Mark, there he goes. Luckily we got the sun behind the clouds for just a few minutes and uh, we gotta get going, you know what I'm saying? All right, adios. All right, here we are at the tip off. Tonto East runs through here and we're going basically in that direction down towards the bottom. I think we got about just over two miles to go. Use a little restroom here. And then uh, behind me here, we came from back around that uh, monster of a mountain. So, and then uh, as you can see, uh, yeah, South Rim is up over there. So this is the tip off mule stop here and everything. And we got a little Ramada shade structure, some water there that you got to filter, but it's all good. And then uh, we'll continue to go over there. So, all right, everyone, see ya. Good, how are you? Good. All right. Can I get a, oh yeah? <laughs> Woo! And my brother working our way down. Soon we're gonna go down in there. We're gonna cross the bridge, and uh, there's uh, where Phantom Ranch is. All that greenery, campsites, cabins, all the good stuff just waiting for us. There you can see a little bit of the Colorado River. And then over there is uh, the North Rim. We're not going there. We came from the south one which is uh way back way back in there somewhere so all right bye guys all right we're gonna keep going down this trail going down hit some of these uh switchbacks no, I'm not. and just continue hit these switchbacks no, and then uh i'm gonna go a little tunnel down over there before the bridge go across the bridge Hit that little trail over there, and then there's a Brady Angel Campground, Phantom Ranch area, waiting for us. Woo! -hoo. Can I get a, oh yeah? Oh yeah. We're at the Colorado River. Crossing Black Bridge. Got the rafters. We got Bright Angel Campground in there. Silver Bridge. Woo, woo.
So Mark, what's happening? Oh, she's going in there too. Yo, how we doing? Just chilling on the Colorado. Water's uh. A little chilly, feels good though. It's supposed to be 102 degrees, so uh, enjoying that. And uh, got the Black Bridge back behind me. That's uh, how we came down South Kaibab. Mark's back there soaking up some some of the water, and then uh, found some rafters over here, and then back down that way. We can't see it, but the Silver Bridge is over there. We'll be going up Bright Angel. So, looking forward, uh, well, maybe not looking forward to that hike, but you know. So, all right, adios. There's Mark back behind me. I'm kind of by the creek over here. Kill me. And uh, it's hot. It's really hot. So, we're over by uh, Phantom Ranch area. Kind of thought we'd come by and check out the store, but they closed about 10 minutes before we got here. That really sucks because they got the awesome lemonade. So we've got nothing. Um, it's hot. It's hot. That's it. That's all I got. No uh, escaping it. We were in the creek for a while, that kind of helped out. Actually went in the river for a bit, that helped out, but uh, we thought the sun was kind of going away and it didn't, so it's hot. And uh, we've got to wait for dinner, like two more hours. We don't want to walk back to nowhere, so we're kind of just gonna hang out here, I guess, for a couple hours and get our reserve meal which is to go because COVID sucks and uh, that's it so thanks for uh, watching us in misery you know what I'm saying adios hey good morning from uh, Bright Angel Campground Who you talking to? over near Phantom Ranch 6 a.m. on a Saturday not too bad. Not too good. About to have some breakfast. Hey, Mark. How you doing? <laughs> so, uh, we're just kind of getting things packed up. Our camp stuff is all behind us. And uh, we'll be going here shortly. And uh, working our way up. Back up that monster. You know what I'm saying? go just left the phantom ranch area this black bridge crossing the colorado on silver bridge and go up that trail over there work it down over there we go up bright angel yo Woo -woo! <laughs> got some wonderful action here the creek Oh, chugging along. This is a really a great little slot canyon kind of deal. Coming along this way. I'll take uh, one step without falling over the edge. Yeah, we were back to there somewhere, so chugging along, not too far now. Is what we keep saying, so adios.
it. Gotta go. All right, so we're chugging along. Um, I think we've gone a few miles. Probably uh, getting pretty close to Indian Garden, I think. I think it's uh, just up, I think that's Plateau Point, so not too far away. Uh, had the mules just go past, you saw, so uh, yeah. Nice little shady spot. We're in a little uh, creek area, but we gotta go. Gotta go. Adios. Hey there, everyone. Oh, we made it to Indian Garden in about uh, two hours and 45 minutes. Coming up uh, 4.5 miles. Successfully made it up the Devil's Corkscrew, which uh, actually we uh, we didn't struggle with. We, we made good time, it feels like, on this one, so that's awesome. We're uh, relaxing underneath the uh, canopy here, soaking up, and uh, we think we're going to get going. Uh, skip uh, a night today because um, trying to sleep last night was uh, miserable. It was just too hot in the tent. There was no circulation. Could not cool off at all. So nothing going on here but um, ravens and squirrels just just fighting for all the crumbs that are laying around. So that's all we got. Talk to you later. All right, we're going up that way somewhere. Probably some several hundred switchbacks as we work our way up from Indian Garden which is back in that greenish area somewhere through there if you can see it so we spent uh, I think about an hour there or something um, maybe that so just enough to refill all the water I actually changed you know socks and everything and now we're cruising a little warm but uh, we got some cloud cover here and there so breaking up the sun and uh, we're uh, taking those breaks in the shade like we're supposed to so so uh, I gotta go up there adios all right so down there in that intersection we came up call that the devil's corkscrew zigzagged around that thing came up all of that and uh, the mules are coming the mules are coming so they're uh, on our tail we're trying to outpace them so good luck with that and uh, I turn around we're going up here and Mark, he's up there. Mark and Mark. All right, got to go because uh, it's kind of hot and uh, we're moving. Adios. Still got a little ways to go to get back up there. Down here on the uh, trail right here. Came down from over there and then who knows, zigzag all the way down back into there. So uh, weather's pretty good. Let's just take a little break. Ready to keep going. Woo -hoo. So that's there's an Indian garden and just a little bit further. Oh, it is the rain. So there's a uh, rain above us too, just a little bit. Got to keep going up, up and up and up. Where to go?
mark. Came from those trails. I don't know, they zigzag all the way down. You can see there and down there. We got a mile to go. Plateau Point is way out there, that line. So we left uh, the Phantom Ranch area this morning. So it's nine miles to the top. That means we got eight done, one to go. Whoop, whoop. All right, made it to the top of Bright Angel. Went down South Kaibab yesterday and uh, that was seven miles. Spent the night down there and nine miles to come up. So glad that is over. That last mile lasted about two and a half miles, uh, but all good, so. It's uh, September 11th, so representing the flag. So never forget. And uh, that's it for now. Gotta go find some real food and hydrate some more. Adios.